All right. So again, today we're doing section 1.5, and we're doing 1 through 30 and 37. I'm going to work with you probably the evens. But the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to work 1 through 7 just to make sure you have a good idea, and then we're going from there. Yes, sir? It's 1 through 30 and 37. Yes, 1 through 30 and 37. All right, Bradley? All right. Here we go. Carly. Help me with number one. What do I have to do first? You have to, um, it's like this. So there's no parentheses, so you have to go parentheses, and then you have to go parentheses, and then you have to go this way. Good. So 16 divided by 4 is 4. Then what? Plus 40. Which is? Uh, 37. You are amazing, girl. Good job. Thomas, you're up. Number two, what do I have to do first? Speak up loud and proud. No, you go in order from left to right, Mr. Dan. You're going to have a hard time on your test if you don't know that. What do I have to do first, Mr. Dan? Four times three first, because we're going in order from left to right for multiplication and division. You happy with that explanation? So what's four times three? What's 12 divided by six? 12 divided by six to two. So now look, here's what we have. So now we have 28 minus two plus four. Does everybody agree with that? Yes. Mr. Dan, what's next? You're awesome. 30. Bradley, you're up. What do I do first? Oh, thank you. Which is? Then what? And then what? I'm proud of you, buddy. That was exactly correct. Yes, sir. No. We're practicing our mental math, right? That's what I'm trying to get you to do. I'm trying to practice your mental math. Now, sometimes you may have to write a couple things down. Okay? Gavin, four. Okay, so first we do 7 times 3, which equals 21, and then 26 minus 21, which is 5, plus 2 is 7. You are awesome. Very nice work. Chloe. Okay, um, first we do the exponent, yep. which is 9 Very good. plus 11, good. which is 20, Good. divided by 5. Man, I'm so good. I'm so proud of myself. Number six. Now let's see how real good I am. Good. No. You, you made a good mistake. This right here is connected. This is multiplication, right? See what I'm saying? So you have to do that first. See so yeah, how this is 6 times 0. The parentheses means multiplication. So you have to do the multiplication before you do the addition. Right? You see it now? That's okay. So what I want you to do is I want you to watch. This means this now. 32 plus 6 times 0 plus 8. This inside here, you said correctly. All of this right here, and watch what I'm going to do. All of this right here that you did is now what? 0. 
Yes. Do you understand me now? That's a zero. So that means you with me now? Yes, nice one. Do that? I know. It's Okay, that was nice, okay? You see that? All right. Now, you can read. Let me hear you. Mm -hmm. Oh, Caleb earned $10 per hour. He worked four hours on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. He worked eight hours on Tuesday and Thursday. Simplify the expression. Okay, so what do I have to do first? Three times four, mm -hmm. and then equals 12, and then two times eight, that equals 16, and you add those together, and it's 28. Um, times 10 mm -hmm. equals 280. You're awesome. That's very good. Very, very good. That's how I want. Yes, sir. Well, you have to times it by zero. Because it says right here, times it by 10. Oh. You see, that's okay. A lot of times people miss. See you tomorrow, Thomas. Bye, Thomas. Bye, Thomas. Very nice, Jack. Okay, so I'm pretty happy with that, right? Yeah. Very good. So we're just going to go around the room, 8, then 9, then we're just going to keep going around the room. All right, but now I said we're going to do the odds, right, because I want to get through everything. Or, I mean, evens. We're going to do the evens because the odds are where? So you can check your work. Is everybody happy? Yes, you're going to do the odds tonight, all right, because we're going to get through the evens. All right, so start with number 8. What do I do first? Okay. This is just good mental math. So we do 7 times 5, yep. which is 35. And then what? And then do you do, um, oh yeah, so 3 plus, okay, so you do 35 plus 3, yep. which is 38, and minus 1 will be 37. You're awesome. All right, Jack, you ready? Um, six times four. Good job, buddy. Um, is twenty-four. And at seven, we have twenty-four minus one. Eight. Go from left to right, please. Is, is one plus one That's your answer. Very good, Jack. Good? All right, Carmen. 12. Uh-oh, this one's a little bit harder. Two to the fifth. Can you, can you count by twos? Powers of two. So let me show you again. Here's what I want you to do. Close. 32. You with me on that? Yeah. So that's 2 to the 5th. So let's put 32 down. Now what? 32 times. Um, we're doing number 12. Oh, man. Yes, I just put it in the right, wrong spot. Thank you. And then what? Good job. Now, let me teach you how to do that. Don't borrow. Let me show you how to do it in your head. Okay, so you go 32 minus 20 first. What's that? 12. Now you're doing 12 minus 3. There you go. See how much easier that is? All right. That's how I'd like for you to learn how to do that. 9 is correct. Okay. 14. I think Bradley's up.
4 times 4 is what? Now, 16 times 4, I want you to tell me 4 times 10. 4 times 6. 40 plus 24. Good, very nice work. Okay. And then, very nice work. All right, 16. This one's kind of a pain. Okay, so. What do I have to do first? We do 8 times 3, or 8 to the power 3, and 8 times 8 is 32. Wait a minute. 8 times 8 to oh. 8 times 8 is 64. So 64 times 8. So mental math is what's 60 times 8? What's six times eight? Four, four hundred eighty. Right. What's six times four, or eight times four? Eight times four is thirty-two. So what's four eighty plus thirty-two? Five hundred. What? Very, very good. So five hundred thirteen, and then we do three times three, which is nine, and then five hundred thirteen. Um, what? Nine, yes. So here's how I want you to think about that. 513 times 9. What's 500 times 9? What's 5 times 9? 4500. Right. What's 9 times 10? 9 times 10 is 90. So far we have. What's nine times three? Nine times three. Four six one seven. Okay, so then. Do you understand that? So then, divided wait nine thousand two hundred thirty four divided by four thousand six hundred seventeen. Mm -hmm. Which? What do you think that is? No, look right here. Look right here. What's the only answer it can be? Three. Yeah, good. Smart. Does everybody understand why it has to be two, right? Three. It can be three. It has to be like 12,000 or 13. Does everybody see that? Three. Since numbers are going evenly, we're just going to say it's two. What? Mm -hmm. 18. What? It's and totally then, okay. And then, right. Then you can do three square divided by nine. Oh, that's not bad. Now let me show you something, okay? I'm eyes up. So essentially we did this. 12 times 12, and then we divided it by 9, right? Mm -hmm. Now, here's how I taught my kids. So it seemed like I knew more than I actually did. I already know the answer is 16. Because I did. 3 goes into 12 four times. 3 goes into 9 what? Three times. 3 goes into 3 once. 3 goes into 12. Everybody see what I did? Mm -hmm. So 4 times 4 is what? 16. So now it was 35 plus 20 times 16. And who can tell me what 20 times 16 is? 16. What's 2 times 10? Yes. 
six times two ends in a what? Two. Right? Because six times two is twelve. All right, so it'd be three hundred and twenty. Um, yes, plus thirty five. Thank you. I'm sorry, I lost my train of thought. So, what's plus thirty five? Three hundred plus five hundred. Yeah, five hundred. Fifty. Remember, you're setting a zero and five. You with me? Again, now, we're really trying to work on our mental math side. All right, so we're really practicing. All right, here we go. Let me find out what's next. 20. What'd you get for that? Come on, tell me. Yeah. So it would be 14 divided by 2, which is yeah. 7, plus 16, which is 20, subtracting 7 from 16. Back to what? 16. Because I did plus 7, then I did what? Minus 7. All right? All right, 22. Give it your best shot. 15 minus 2 is 16. Very good. Twenty four. Yeah. Yep, give it a shot for me. So we would do um so we would do um we do five plus three. Yes, which is correct. Right. right. And then Seven, seven, seven squared. Okay. Yeah. Plus one. Yes. Yes. All right. Bye. Finish this up tonight, okay, girl? Good. Divided by two is eight. Yes, sir. And then ten divided by two is five plus six is eleven. You're awesome. So it's left. What do I have to do? Good. Good. Very nice. Very nice, very nice. All right, here we go. Let's do 30. Let's keep it going. Okay, so 18 minus 14 equals 4. Good. 2 plus 2 Good. is 4. So it's 0. Wait a minute. Oh, it's four, 1. 1. That's okay. So this is 1. Okay, Next side. 4. And then, so you would do 4 divided by 2. You mean 14. Er, that's oh, a, 14 divided by 2, yeah. Which so is? So, equals 7. Good. And then we do 7, 18 minus 7 Good. equals 11. Good. Okay. Plus 2, 13. So? So, it is. That's a symbol for less than. Very good. All right, it was 1 through 30 and then 37, right? Okay. So Bertha earned eight dollars per hour for four hours babysitting, a hundred dollars per hour for five hours painting. I need to simplify this expression. Okay. So eight times four is thirty-two. Right. And then ten times five is fifty. So. And then that'd be eighteen. Yeah. Good job. Very nice. Eighty-two bucks she made. All right.